What is the meaning of the verb fall down? When people or things fall to the ground from a higher position, they fall down. I slipped on some ice on the sidewalk and fell down. What is the meaning of the verb put down, on? When an airplane puts down or a pilot puts an airplane down, the airplane lands. Fortunately, the pilot was able to put the plane down on a frozen lake. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When you move to a lower level or position or from north to south, you go down or go down to that place. Go up is the opposite of go down. Toronto is too cold, so we usually go down to Mexico in the winter. What is the meaning of the verb put down, on slash 4? When you add something to a list or other written material, you put it down or put it down on the list. Melanie's collecting money for charity, so I told her to put me down for $50. What is the meaning of the verb take back, to? When something reminds you of a place where you were in the past or of something you experienced in the past. It takes you back or takes you back to a time in the past. My grandfather found his old uniform in the attic.
and he said it took him back to when he was stationed in England during the war. What is the meaning of the verb take back? When you take back something that you have said, you admit that what you said was untrue, unfair, or rude. That's not true. You take that back right now. What is the meaning of the verb put down, on? When you put money down or put money down on something, you pay a portion of the cost of something you want. To buy to be sure that it will still be available to you when you are able to pay the rest of the cost. The real estate agent asked me how much money I want to put down on the house. What is the meaning of the verb calm down? When a confused or violent situation becomes less confused or violent, it calms down. When you calm a confused or violent situation down, you make it less confused or violent and more calm. Settle down is similar to calm down. A conference between the two sides was organized to try to calm the situation down. What is the meaning of the verb fool around? When you waste time playing or doing silly or unimportant things, you fool around. Goof around is the same as fool around. My son is lazy. He spends his time fooling around instead of looking for a job.
My boss said, I'm not paying you to fool around get to work. What is the meaning of the verb take back? When you take back something that you have said, you admit that what you said was untrue, unfair, or rude. I'm sorry, that was very rude of me. I take it back. What is the meaning of the verb take back, to? When you take people back or take people back to a place where they were before. You go with them to that place. Our son was home from college for the summer, and we're taking him back tomorrow. What is the meaning of the verb take back, to? When you take back something that you have borrowed or take back something that you have borrowed to the person or place that you borrowed it from, you return it. I need to take Jim's lawnmower back to him. What is the meaning of the verb fall down? When people or things fall to the ground from a higher position, they fall down. All the dishes on that shelf will fall down if there's another earthquake. What is the meaning of the verb fool around, with? When you fool around with something, you do something that may be dangerous or foolish.
you shouldn't fool around with the insides of your computer unless you know what you're doing. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When the cost, rate, quality, quantity, or level of something decreases, it goes down. Go up is the opposite of go down. The crime rate in New York City has gone down. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When something extends to a certain point that is farther south or at a lower elevation. It goes down to that point. Go up is the opposite of go down. How far south does this road go down? What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When something extends to a certain point that is farther south or at a lower elevation. It goes down to that point. Go up is the opposite of go down. Does this road go down to the south side of town? What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When something extends to a certain point that is farther south or at a lower elevation. It goes down to that point. Go up is the opposite of go down. After dinner we went down to the basement and played ping pong.
What is the meaning of the verb run down, to? When you move quickly to a lower level or place, you run down or run down to that place. I saw someone trying to steal my car, and I ran down to the street to try to stop him. What is the meaning of the verb put down, on slash 4? When you add something to a list or other written material, you put it down or put it down on the list. I'm making a list of volunteers to help re-elect Senator Doolittle. Can I put your name down on the list? What is the meaning of the verb put down? When you put people down, you criticize them. Jim hates his stepfather and puts him down constantly. I'm not inviting Sam to any more parties. I hate the way he puts everyone down. What is the meaning of the verb take back, from? When you take something back or take something back from someone else. You accept it from the person you gave, sold, or lent it to. The lady I bought this Persian rug from said she would. Be happy to take it back from me if I changed my mind. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When the cost, rate, quality, quantity, or level of something decreases, it goes down.
Go up is the opposite of go down. The temperature went down to zero last night. What is the meaning of the verb take back, to? When you take back something that you have borrowed or take back something that You have borrowed to the person or place that you borrowed it from, you return it. Lydia borrowed this book from the library six months ago, and she still hasn't taken it back. What is the meaning of the verb run down, to? When you move quickly to a lower level or place, you run down or run down to that place. Mike was running down the stairs when he fell and broke his leg. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When vehicles or people driving vehicles hit and injure or kill someone, they run that person down. Ali was arrested after he ran three people down. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When you discuss or review items on a list from the first to the last, you run down the list. The teacher ran down the list of students and marked the ones who are failing. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When you discuss or review items on a list from the first to the last, you run down the list. The teacher ran down the list of students and marked the ones who are failing.
What is the meaning of the verb run down? When batteries or machines run down or are run down by someone, they gradually lose power or energy. Don't leave the car lights on for too long when the car isn't running or the battery will run down. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When batteries or machines run down or are run down by someone, they gradually lose power or energy. Don't leave the car lights on for too long when the car isn't running or the battery will run down. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When batteries or machines run down or are run down by someone, they gradually lose power or energy. What time is it? My watch ran down last night. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When batteries or machines run down or are run down by someone, they gradually lose power or energy. What time is it? My watch ran down last night. What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit down, you change from a standing position to a sitting position. The teacher told his students to sit down and open their books. What is the meaning of the verb sit down?
when you sit down, you change from a standing position to a sitting position. The teacher told his students to sit down and open their books. What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit down, you change from a standing position to a sitting position. I'm exhausted, I haven't sat down all day. What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit down, you change from a standing position to a sitting position. I'm exhausted, I haven't sat down all day. What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit people down, you order them to sit, usually so that you can have a serious discussion. When I found marijuana in my daughter's purse, I sat her down and had a serious talk with her. What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit people down, you order them to sit, usually so that you can have a serious discussion. When I found marijuana in my daughter's purse, I sat her down and had a serious talk with her. What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit people down, you order them to sit, usually so that you can have a serious discussion. The detective sat Hank down and began to interrogate him.
What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit people down, you order them to sit, usually so that you can have a serious discussion. The detective sat Hank down and began to interrogate him. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush people off, you ignore them or refuse to listen to them. Because you are not interested in or do not like what they are saying. My boss just brushes me off when I try to tell her how to increase our profits. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush people off, you ignore them or refuse to listen to them. Because you are not interested in or do not like what they are saying. My boss just brushes me off when I try to tell her how to increase our profits. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush people off, you ignore them or refuse to listen to them. Because you are not interested in or do not like what they are saying. The reporters tried to ask him some questions, but he brushed them off. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush people off, you ignore them or refuse to listen to them. Because you are not interested in or do not like what they are saying.
The reporters tried to ask him some questions, but he brushed them off. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush off a critical remark or problem. You ignore it and continue as before without letting it affect you. I told DR. Smith that he had made a mistake, but he brushed it off. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush off a critical remark or problem. You ignore it and continue as before without letting it affect you. I told DR. Smith that he had made a mistake, but he brushed it off. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush off a critical remark or problem. You ignore it and continue as before without letting it affect you. My father's cholesterol is very high, but he just brushes it off. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush off a critical remark or problem. You ignore it and continue as before without letting it affect you. My father's cholesterol is very high, but he just brushes it off. What is the meaning of the verb come on?
when an electrical device or machine comes on, it begins to operate, usually automatically. Go off is the opposite of come on. It was so cold that the heat came on last night. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When an electrical device or machine comes on, it begins to operate, usually automatically. Go off is the opposite of come on. It was so cold that the heat came on last night. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When something goes down in a certain way, people react to or perceive it in this way. The new no smoking policy didn't go down very well with the smokers in the office. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When batteries or machines run down or are run down by someone, they gradually lose power or energy. What time is it? My watch ran down last night. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush people off, you ignore them or refuse to listen to them. Because you are not interested in or do not like what they are saying. The reporters tried to ask him some questions, but he brushed them off. What is the meaning of the verb sit down?
When you sit people down, you order them to sit, usually so that you can have a serious discussion. When I found marijuana in my daughter's purse, I sat her down and had a serious talk with her. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When people go by a place or thing, they pass near that place or thing. When a thing goes by or goes by you, it passes near you. I went by Jim's house to see if his car was in the driveway. What is the meaning of the verb lay down? When you lay down a new law, policy, rule, and so on, you create and announce it. The IRS laid down several new tax regulations. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When you go by a clock, you use it to tell the time. No wonder I'm always late for work the clock I've been going by is 10 minutes slow. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush off a critical remark or problem. You ignore it and continue as before without letting it affect you. I told DR. Smith that he had made a mistake, but he brushed it off. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When a period of time goes by, it passes.
As time went by, Betty moved up in the company until she was the head of the finance department. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When an electrical device or machine comes on, it begins to operate, usually automatically. Go off is the opposite of come on. It was so cold that the heat came on last night. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When a computer or computer network stops working because of a problem or because it has been disconnected, it goes down. I couldn't withdraw any money at the bank because its computers had gone down. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush off a critical remark or problem. You ignore it and continue as before without letting it affect you. My father's cholesterol is very high, but he just brushes it off. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When you go by a policy or standard. You use it as a reference or a guide in making decisions and determining your behavior. When you go by the book. You follow rules, policies, or laws exactly. Jim told me to do one thing, and Tom told me to do another. But since Tom is the boss, I'm going to go by what he says.
What is the meaning of the verb go by? When you go by a clock, you use it to tell the time. Don't go by the clock on the wall, it's fast. Go by the clock on the desk. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When you go by a policy or standard. You use it as a reference or a guide in making decisions and determining your behavior. When you go by the book, you follow rules, policies, or laws exactly. Going by the book has always been my policy. What is the meaning of the verb brush off? When you brush people off, you ignore them or refuse to listen to them. Because you are not interested in or do not like what they are saying. My boss just brushes me off when I try to tell her how to increase our profits. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When people go by a place or thing, they pass near that place or thing. When a thing goes by or goes by you, it passes near you. We watched the parade go by. What is the meaning of the verb foot around, with, informal? When two people fool around or fool around with each other, they have sexual relations.
even though one or both of them may be married to someone else or even though their families or society may not approve. Her husband's been fooling around with his secretary, and everyone in town knows it. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When you go by a place, you go there so that you can do something or get something. Let's go by Paul's house to get his tools before we work on your car. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When you discuss or review items on a list from the first to the last, you run down the list. The teacher ran down the list of students and marked the ones who are failing. What is the meaning of the verb foot around, with, informal? When two people fool around or fool around with each other, they have sexual relations. Even though one or both of them may be married to someone else or even though their families or society may not approve. Sally's father caught her and Jim fooling around in the basement. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When something goes down in a certain way, people react to or perceive it in this way. The judge's decision went down well with the prosecutor. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When the sun goes below the horizon, it goes down.
after the sun goes down, it'll get a little cooler. What is the meaning of the verb lay down, on? When you lay something down, you put it on a horizontal surface. Put down is similar to lay down. The police order Jake to lay down his gun and surrender. What is the meaning of the verb put down? When you put something down. You put something in your hand or something that you are carrying on a horizontal surface. The suitcase was so heavy that I had to put it down and rest for a minute. What is the meaning of the verb run down? When batteries or machines run down or are run down by someone, they gradually lose power or energy. Don't leave the car lights on for too long when the car isn't running or the battery will run down. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When you go by a place, you go there so that you can do something or get something. You can forget about going by the dry cleaner to pick up your stuff it's closed. What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit down, you change from a standing position to a sitting position. I'm exhausted, I haven't sat down all day.
What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit people down, you order them to sit, usually so that you can have a serious discussion. The detective sat Hank down and began to interrogate him. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When a computer or computer network stops working because of a problem or because it has been disconnected, it goes down. If your computer terminal goes down, you can use the one in the next office. What is the meaning of the verb put down? When you put something down. You put something in your hand or something that you are carrying on a horizontal surface. Susie, put that knife down. It's dangerous. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When the sun goes below the horizon, it goes down. The sun went down at 8.34 last night. What is the meaning of the verb sit down? When you sit down, you change from a standing position to a sitting position. The teacher told his students to sit down and open their books. What is the meaning of the verb lay down?
when you lay down a new law, policy, rule, and so on, you create and announce it. Congress decided against laying down any new campaign financing laws. What is the meaning of the verb lay down, on? When you lay something down, you put it on a horizontal surface. Put down is similar to lay down. Marshall laid the tray down. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When a period of time goes by, it passes. I can't believe that 30 years have gone by since I got out of high school. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When an electrical device or machine comes on, it begins to operate, usually automatically. Go off is the opposite of come on. When you open the refrigerator door, the light comes on automatically. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When an electrical device or machine comes on, it begins to operate, usually automatically. Go off is the opposite of come on. When you open the refrigerator door, the light comes on automatically. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When a television or radio program comes on, it begins.
Do you know when the news will come on? What is the meaning of the verb come on? When a television or radio program comes on, it begins. Do you know when the news will come on? What is the meaning of the verb come on? When a television or radio program comes on, it begins. The late movie comes on at 1 o'clock a. M. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When a television or radio program comes on, it begins. The late movie comes on at 1 o'clock a. M. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you want to encourage people to do something or when. You want them to do something quickly. You say come on. Believe me, you're going to love this garlic ice cream. Come on, try it. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you want to encourage people to do something or when. You want them to do something quickly. You say come on. Believe me, you're going to love this garlic ice cream.
Come on, try it. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you want to encourage people to do something or when. You want them to do something quickly, you say come on. Come on. I can't wait all day. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you want to encourage people to do something or when. You want them to do something quickly, you say come on. Come on. I can't wait all day. What is the meaning of the verb come on informal? When you think that people have done or said something improper or unreasonable, you say come on. Tom didn't study for one minute, and you're telling me he got 100 on the test? Come on. What is the meaning of the verb come on informal? When you think that people have done or said something improper or unreasonable, you say come on. Tom didn't study for one minute, and you're telling me he got 100 on the test? Come on. What is the meaning of the verb come on informal? When you think that people have done or said something improper or unreasonable, you say come on.
Hey, come on. I told you not to do that again. What is the meaning of the verb come on informal? When you think that people have done or said something improper or unreasonable, you say come on. Hey, come on. I told you not to do that again. What is the meaning of the verb come on always continuous? When you begin to feel a headache or an illness developing, you feel the headache or illness coming on. I might be sick tomorrow, I feel something coming on. What is the meaning of the verb come on always continuous? When you begin to feel a headache or an illness developing, you feel the headache or illness coming on. I might be sick tomorrow, I feel something coming on. What is the meaning of the verb come on always continuous? When you begin to feel a headache or an illness developing, you feel the headache or illness coming on. I feel a headache coming on. Do you have any aspirin? What is the meaning of the verb come on always continuous? When you begin to feel a headache or an illness developing, you feel the headache or illness coming on. I feel a headache coming on.
Do you have any aspirin? What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you come on a certain way, you speak or deal with people in that way. Paul needs to learn to be more of a gentleman. He comes on too strong, and women don't like that. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you come on a certain way, you speak or deal with people in that way. Paul needs to learn to be more of a gentleman. He comes on too strong, and women don't like that. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you come on a certain way, you speak or deal with people in that way. Bob comes on kind of arrogant, but he's actually a nice guy. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you come on a certain way, you speak or deal with people in that way. Bob comes on kind of arrogant, but he's actually a nice guy. What is the meaning of the verb come on, to, informal? When you come on to people, you approach them and try to interest them in romance or sex. Toad came on to Judy at the party, and she told him to get lost. What is the meaning of the verb come on, to, informal?
When you come on to people, you approach them and try to interest them in romance or sex. Toad came on to Judy at the party, and she told him to get lost. What is the meaning of the verb put down, on? When an airplane puts down or a pilot puts an airplane down, the airplane lands. After the engine quit, the pilot looked for a place to put down. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When a television or radio program comes on, it begins. The late movie comes on at 1 o'clock a. M. What is the meaning of the verb put down, on slash 4? When you add something to a list or other written material, you put it down or put it down on the list. I'm making a list of volunteers to help re-elect Senator Doolittle. Can I put your name down on the list? What is the meaning of the verb put down, on? When an airplane puts down or a pilot puts an airplane down, the airplane lands. Fortunately, the pilot was able to put the plane down on a frozen lake. What is the meaning of the verb live with? When you live with someone, you live at the same address.
when you say that one person lives with a person of the opposite sex. You mean that they live in the same place but are not married? Mike's been living with his girlfriend for five years. Are they ever going to get married? What is the meaning of the verb come on always continuous? When you begin to feel a headache or an illness developing, you feel the headache or illness coming on. I might be sick tomorrow, I feel something coming on. What is the meaning of the verb come on informal? When you think that people have done or said something improper or unreasonable, you say come on. Tom didn't study for one minute, and you're telling me he got 100 on the test? Oh, come on. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When you come on a certain way, you speak or deal with people in that way. Paul needs to learn to be more of a gentleman. He comes on too strong, and women don't like that. 